Uh, we're going to dive into a, a, a little a little piece from that because I think there's a, a, a interesting discussion to go on around it. Um, not to get into any political kind of aspects, but um, so there was kind of a throwdown on social media because we love when people are 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 all kinds of upstanding citizens on social media around here, right, guys? In pro wrestling, because absolutely yeah, everybody man. is, right? I mean, sure. I mean, come on, nobody's not messed all. up on social media and pro wrestling. Yeah, we're not interested in news in news items. No, no, not at all. <laughs> but of course, there's a, a video going around Joey Ryan who 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 struck viral video gold. I think he was in Japan, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know. Amin might be lurking, so he can correct DDT. me out there. Uh, it's called DDT. I don't remember what it's called or DDT. what it stands for, but. Um, but I think one of the words is dong. Uh, but there was a, a little bit of a video. It is now. It is now. That's what they're known for. Might as well, might as well lean into that. You know what I mean? Um, TLC and D. <laughs> I'm, how do you win that match? <laughs> well, sorry, right. sorry, you have to finish before you're allowed to climb the ladder. Oh, okay, you. move. Oh, okay, solid. solid. That's that makes sense. sense. That's what we're talking about. But there was a, there was a a move, and, and and Joey Ryan, we've seen him locally with the IWC and Ring of Vo- Ring of Honor. Yeah, he's been in Ring of Honor, I think. Um, and uh, you know, it, he's a very uh, uh, porn star ish type. Oh, I did not watch the Grado video. I'm sorry about that. Um, but uh, so they, they they did they did a thing where where he grabbed his he, he grabbed his junk and and and. And it hurt him. Mm-hmm. It's a very hilarious clip. Am I am I accurately describing this <laughs> it, <laughs> for our audio listeners? Sor gets a test of strength mm-hmm. with fist versus penis. Fist versus penis. Okay. Oh, okay. Also, the name of my favorite Chikara trios match: fist versus penis. Uh. See, <laughs> so Cars gets it because there was a team called Fist. <laughs> Okay, bad, like, okay. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> yeah, we just broke cars. Okay, and cried. that's the last time Alex Cars will be on the Wrestling Mayhem show. <laughs> um, but this this led to controversy because uh, Jim Cornette responded. I, I don't even know why he like caught on to this. Um, but Jim oh, somebody, somebody asked. He has nothing to else to do. Somebody asked, but uh, but he remember, says. You remember uh, last time I was on the show and I talked about how Vince Russo continues to talk as if. His opinion matters in professional wrestling. Right, right, right. Just copy and paste that, but where it says um, uh, uh, Vince Russo, replace it with Jim Cornette. Right, exactly. I was going to say, replace 1990s with 1980s. <laughs> Something like that. Uh, uh-huh. But he, he, he responded to, to a fan and says, uh, won't watch the video, but the, somebody apparently asked if, if he had seen the video. Um, he says, won't watch the video, but the pick from Joey Ryan Online appears to uh enjoy staying over men with his uh something 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 um and and that turned into you know uh, saying hey that's really homophobic etc cetera, etc cetera. and then it led to a conversation about kind of you know uh Jim Cornette going into a tirade about uh you know uh about being an embarrassment to wrestling embarrassment to wrestling and everything and of course we, you know we just had a big conversation about Chikara uh Alex talks about it every week right and um I think I th- again. This is just an old, I think an old old thought here. I and mean, we talk about a variety of things like Lucha Underground. Did you know some people don't like Lucha Underground? Sork, who are, are those, those people, people who have not watched it? <laughs> are, can <laughs> we shoot people? those people into the sun? Whoa! And yes, with a copy of um, USWA. Um, but uh, you mean GWA? No, uh, Bob, US, just, uh, I swear I was watching USWA this week. I don't know. There were a lot of letters and a lot of people with mullets and 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 a lot of Jim Cornette. Okay, which I can't wait to watch Global Force on the WWE. <laughs> it's not oh, the God. global. It's Global Force. But by, by the way, Anyways. Sork um, on ProWrestlingTees dot com, mm-hmm. there is apparently a Joey Ryan. King of Dong style shirt. Yes, there is because Joey Ryan yeah, knows do. how to capitalize on this kind of stuff. Um, but I, I think I think it's a good point of um, hey guys, there's a lot of wrestling out there these days, and there's a lot of creativity in wrestling these days. And and while you know we're kind of 
we're you know like we talked about last week about the old wrestling um we, we had a smoky mountains uswa popped up stampedes on there um there's a lot of great 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 stuff but can you really say there was a lot of variety in comparison back then like i feel like even though the stuff is great it's all just a version of what they're doing down the road now granted there wasn't a lot of crossover these were territories right you know it's not like today where we get to see what you know, uh, Dong Fu is doing over there in Japan and DDT. Um, you know, I, I, I think, you know, I, 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 I and, and obviously Jim Cornette's of another era uh, in that respect. But, um, man, no, this is the, this is the, this is the sport, quote, that had the gobbledygooker. You know what I mean? Um, Adrian Adonis. Short. Uh, Short. Yeah, gorgeous George. And, and, you, and you're going to uh, throw down on that. May Young gave birth to a hand. And I think that closes the discussion. I don't think anybody has anything else to say on that. Alex, Will, LB? No. Oh, man. <laughs> you can't really follow that up, can you, um, at that point? I mean, as far as I'm concerned, everyone loves something different about wrestling. Mm-hmm. You know, some people love Chikara and, you know, everything about that. Some people love the current WWE product. Some people don't. They love the Attitude Era, the new generation you know, before that. Some right. people enjoy the, the era of Jim Cornette. Uh, I know Jim Cornette seems to enjoy the era of Jim Cornette. <laughs> but, you know, I mean, you know, everyone has their opinion. I just, I don't know. I think the whole thing kind of, uh, and, and I, like, I've always been, I've been a fan of Joey Ryan. I mean, not everything about Joey Ryan I'm a fan of, but the wrestler, like, in general, I've been a fan of for quite some time. I met the guy in 2012, you know, there's just, you know, things about Joey Ryan that, uh, like, I do enjoy watching. And so the whole video and the video and the Jim Cornette thing aside, you know, I just, you know, that's, I guess everyone just has their own opinion about it. But, you know, it, it's very telling of the different eras of wrestling when you have a conversation like that on Twitter in 2015. Right. Right. LB, got anything to say before we roll on? No, no, I'm good. Fuck Jim Cornette. That's all. Good point on that. All right, guys. <laughs> hey, you know what's you know what we can all agree on around here? Slice on Broadway. And uh, I'm sorry, Alex, you're a little too far out of the delivery zone out in uh, out in California. Just mail me a postcard with a picture of a pizza from Slice on Broadway. I'm gonna take a slice. I'm gonna stick it. I'm gonna throw a stamp on this slice this this uh, slice yeah. of slice pepperoni. And send and it please, out your please, way, man. Please let it be because we're already sent it. Oh, oh, great stuff. Oh, I'm getting hungry again. Uh, eh. It's on Broadway.com. Uh, check them out there if you're in the South Hills.